The genes of the alpha globin gene cluster from 5' prime to 3' prime are zeta, alpha 2 and alpha 1. These are arranged in the order in which they are expressed during development. The zeta gene is expressed during embryonic development and the alpha gene is expressed later on in adulthood. The expression of the genes at different time stages causes different variants of the haemoglobin molecule to be synthesised. Expression of zeta and epsilon forms the embryonic haemoglobin GAWA1. Zeta and delta forms the Portland variant. Alpha and gamma forms fetal haemoglobin. In adulthood, alpha, beta and alpha delta genes are expressed, forming the adult haemoglobin A and haemoglobin A2, respectively. If we look at the synthesis of haemoglobin over time, almost immediately after conception, during the embryonic phase, variants named GAL1, 2 and Portland are expressed. These decline rapidly around 10 to 12 weeks of age, and haemoglobin F, HBF, is expressed and actually persists after birth. Adult forms of haemoglobin do start to appear before birth but rise rapidly at the time of birth and plateau out in infancy around nine months of age. And haemoglobin A is the most common adult haemoglobin variant. Other variant forms of haemoglobin can cause disease. Haemoglobin S is found in people with sickle cell disease where there is a change in the properties of the haemoglobin that result in the sickling of red blood cells. Other haemoglobin variants are found with people with thalassemia and together these conditions are known as haemoglobinopathy.